Hey guys, so today's video is about the Midori MD notebooks. Um, I got this on sale during Fountain Pen Day and um, I just really wanted to try out the, the notebook and the paper itself. I kind of wanted the, I think, A5 size, which I think is slightly larger than this, and this is the A6. I could be wrong, but I wanted the one that was slightly larger than this 4x6 one. But I'm excited to get it started. So it comes wrapped and it's wrapped like this. And I got the grid. I'm trying to figure out what I want to use this for. And my idea at the moment is pr a projects journal or a projects notebook. When January starts, I will be starting an actual bullet journal compared to this one that I've been using in my TN, which is just kind of jotting down things and stuff like that and not really being able to plan too much. But I'm going to actually use a Lustrum notebook journal for my note for my bullet journal and then for this one i think i'm going to use it as a project journal to go into depths for video ideas blog ideas things i want to paint things i want to make knit stuff like that so it comes like this wrapped super cute it's a japanese it's a midori brand i just thought it was super cute and it was i got it half off so then i had to purchase the cover and i didn't want to buy a leather cover because i have my my tn and that's that's good enough for me. I didn't want this one to be as fancy. I decided to just get the clear cover. And so here's the wrapping for that clear cover. Same kind of stuff. And here it is wrapped around. And it comes with a pen loop. And you can put stuff here in this pocket, like right here. Slide some stuff in here and slide some stuff in here. And I decided I will decorate the cover. So the paper is grid. And it has like, doesn't fully go across the whole page. So it's slightly smaller. It lays flat when you kind of, when you, when you press it down, it lays flat. It's a nice little sized notebook. And so I did some testing on some pens right here. So I have my Monza, my Lamy, my Caveco, and my Eco, and a new, the new R2D2 pen that I have. And they all do pretty well. So they don't all, they all, it doesn't, the shadows a little bit, but it doesn't ever bleed through. So I'm pretty happy with that. I think I'm going to use this as a projects notebook and just carry it with me. It's pretty light, so then maybe carry it on top of that and just have that as my carry-on. We'll see. Maybe some days this will stay home and some days I'll bring it with me. We'll see how it goes. I'm still kind of intimidated to start a full-on bullet journal, but I'm very uh, motivated to do it and I really want to do it, but I want also something that will be able to help me plan out all of my projects and keep that in because I, I keep my my TN as a daily journal and I don't think I want to keep anything else. I think once I take this uh, bullet journal insert out, I will just put in a sketchbook. Anyway guys, that's all I have for you today and I will talk to you next time. Bye!